Hey, what's up, YouTube? Zachberry here. So today I'm going to show you guys how to make a really cool blow gun. Uh, this is going to be able to blow darts uh, really fast. So that's what we're going to be making today. So the things you're going to need for this uh, project, um, you're going to need a two foot long piece of uh, half inch PVC. Looks like this. Two feet long. Uh, you can see it's half, half inch right there. Um, and then uh, these are actually uh, um, different pieces. Uh, at my hard store, uh, they didn't have it. What you're going to need is a, um, is a uh, one half by three fourth female um, uh, uh, thread slip. Yeah, so it's one, uh, one half by three fourths uh, 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 thread slip um, adapter uh, female. Uh, they didn't have it at my local hard st um, hardware store. Um, I just went to Lowe's. They didn't have it, so this guy basically rigged something up for us uh, to where it's just two pieces, and one fits over one like that, and then it goes over the half inch like this. But uh, but you can probably find uh, just uh, just one that's already put together at your local hardware store. So you're gonna do that, and you're gonna need a rubber mallet. So let's get to the next step. So for me, I had these two pieces, so I just put this on here. And pressed it down. Uh, I took this rubber mallet and I just gave it one little twap there. So now it's pretty well in there. And now what we're gonna do is we're gonna put this up right here. And basically, um, I'm gonna put this onto the PVC pipe. So just like that. And now uh, we're gonna tap it in with a hammer, just like that. It probably doesn't look any different, but that's how it should look now. So now you're gonna have this. And now there's your uh, the blow gun is, uh, is ready to use right now. If you want to clean it up a little bit, you could sandpaper it, um, um, I spray paint it, um, or put some duct tape on it. But it goes over your mouth like this. And you just blow. It sits like this. <laughs> That's like my trombone sound. But you just go like this and you go. <laughs> or, you, or you blow as hard as you can, and then it'll basically just fly out at supersonic speed. So. Here's what it looks like. Nice look. All right, guys. So I'm back, and now uh, after you get all the parts, um, this is the PVC you just saw. Um, I put a little green duct tape on there, and then electrical taped both ends to make it look a little cleaner. And here's the end. This is the end you blow out of. Right there. Okay. Now for the ammunition, I'm using something very simple. You can get pretty much at any store. Mini marshmallows. Um, these are Mini marshmallows, pretty freaking simple. Sorry, my parents are yelling out there. Uh, so they're just really small and they uh, fit perfectly in two inch PVC. I mean, <laughs> no, freaking two inch. Um, um, and half inch PVC, just like that. You see there? Push them down in and then you go ahead and shoot. So I'm gonna empty this out now. So there you go. All right, so that's what I'm shooting, okay? So, um, as I showed you before, uh, the stuff I'm shooting are these little mini marshmallows here. There's little baby marshmallows. Um, now, what's really cool is that these things are super duper cheap, and they are actually edible. So, if uh, if you shoot ammo and you don't, um, and you're just done with it, you just nice simple treat. Yummy. Um, so, yeah, and I also made some modifications to the actual blow gun. Um, I added a, uh, this is actually a GoPro mount. This GoPro mount is actually a bike mount and you attach this to the handle of a bike uh, and you can film yourself riding around everywhere. So that's what I did and it actually makes a surprisingly good handle and it's actually a sight too. So if I were to aim this up here and show you, look at that, it's a sight. So you just sight something with, uh, with these two, like those two pillars right here, these things. And uh, you just sight it, and then you blow right there, and it shoots. So that's a really cool feature. I, uh, I discovered when doing that, or when putting up my thumb. Ow. Okay. Anyway, uh, so yeah, that's a really cool thing that um, I did. So also, if you want to make these things a little more dangerous, if you're aiming towards that, go ahead and take a mini marshmallow, and you're going to need some carpenter nails. Um, and, uh, well, that's what they're called, uh, where I'm from, um, but, uh, I don't know what size they are, just look right here, you can see the size and everything, 1 by 17, uh, they're really simple, and they're super duper little tiny nails, like, they're 
like the size of like my fingertips okay so I already have one set out here so what you want to do is it's basically just take the nail and you just want to stick it through the marshmallow sorry about that um, you want to stick it to the marshmallow until you get about right until the head rests right there on the end that's how far you want it to go so now you have a little freaking deadly it's not really in the middle let me try it again with another marshmallow and another and another little thingy so we have a nice dry marshmallow that one's all wet and sticky because I've been shooting it so just go right here and then just push it through until it gets to the middle and then push and then pull it until you can see the head, but you don't want it to go too far into the into the um, into the um, marshmallow where you can't see it. But the reason the nails stay in there is because they're sticking to the marshmallow. Uh, so every time you shoot it, the marshmallow is getting stickier and stickier. So the nail ain't going anywhere. I've shot it multiple times, and the nail doesn't really go anywhere. It just stays with the marshmallow. So uh, yeah, and it works really good. So it just loads in there like before, and you stick it in like so and then you just blow. Uh, I don't have a little connector valve on there. There it is. So there you go. And then you just go ahead and just blow and you have this this sight here and then you have the more deadlier version. Um, I would recommend shooting this at targets. Do not shoot this at people. Do not shoot this at people because it'll probably take out their eye. Uh, it's very dangerous. So make sure you guys be uh, cautious with that. So now I'm going to do some firing tests for you guys. Hey guys, so I'm going to be aiming at that uh, cup over there. And so uh, I'm going to be shooting, uh, I'm not going to shoot the uh, uh, the nails, uh, uh, the nailed ones yet. I'll just be shooting the regular ones by themselves. Oh, where are you going, phone? You need to cooperate with me here. So yeah, I'm going to be uh, shooting the friendly ones. So, put in there, let me see if I can hit it. Uh, I got it close, I got it close. Let's do it again. Here we go. <laughs> oh, dang it. That one's gone. Let's try it again. Ah, oh, man, I'm getting close here. Let's do it again. And there we go, mission success. So now we're going to do some slow motion. Alright guys, so now um, I'm going to be shooting at that water bottle uh, with the pointed one, with the one with the nail in it. I'm going to be shooting with that. We're just going to see if we can penetrate it. That's all I really care about. The penetrate stuff, that is pretty cool. Okay, let's try it. I just got to get the freaking nail to go in. That's the biggest hassle. Alright, sorry guys, hold on. Here we go. If it'll work. <laughs> nope, didn't penetrate it. Let's try it again. Or it can just fall out the end. That's just great. Try it one more time. <laughs> Alright, so it does look like it's uh, sticking in there. Um, but I think it does have the potential to. Uh, I think it's just not flying straight. I think it's just. Because you can see where it's hitting. You can see a little mix in there that's bouncing off. Uh, I don't think it has the power to penetrate it because even if I try to do it, the nail just doesn't stick in. Uh, I think it's too light of a nail to actually really stick in there. So anyway, um, so that's the video, guys. Um, hope you do like this project. Um, help you out. Ha, 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 ha. Okay, so yeah, um, I hope you like the project, guys. I worked really um, well, I don't work really hard on this, but um, it's, uh, it's 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 one of my favorite projects I've done. It's really fun, and it's, uh, it's just a fun thing to do around the house. Uh, make sure you pick up all the uh, uh, all the marshmallows because you could get ants. So, yep. That's it, guys. Thanks for watching. I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace and love.